What's going on, you guys? My name is Morgan, and welcome back to another Dying Light 2 video. So, we're gonna pick up where we left off, and we're going to see Mia, or we're gonna go meet the informant who knows where Mia is. And she's alive, so we've got a long way to go to Old Villador. So, let's go meet this informant and see what he has to say to us. And again, I, I'm not crazy about how dark it is. I can't entirely see everything. Uh, it's a little bit of a struggle. So, I've kind of been relying on, you know, the senses. But, hopefully we'll be getting this flashlight soon so we can continue with our being able to see. That would be great. But this is one of my favorite parts of that. Um, jumping into the water but seeing where these bridges broke off but my favorite part absolutely is jumping into this water it's just you know I, I wish i would make a dive motion that would be even better but let's swim our way and go see what this informant has to say Hello? It's Aiden. Can you hear me now? Loud and clear. You must be close. I swam across the lake. So, you've almost reached the top. There's an entrance. The only one the GRE left when they sealed up the city. I'll come from the other side. Hurry up. What's wrong? Hurry. Yes, we need to hurry. We, hurry. we all know what's going to happen when we get in there. And I have never been a fan of going in the dark in these games. I think I've said that already. And I'm really not looking forward to that right now either. So, like, here goes nothing. And let's try not to, uh, you know, lose it too much. Uh, poop our pants, if we will. But let's roll... Kill, we'll uh, kill some zombies, kill some infected, and gather some more supplies before we head to the tunnels. But try to dodge them for the most part because there are a lot and I'm not really in the mood to deal with them right now. Maybe if I had better weapons and it wouldn't take so long, but we've got things to do. Even though this is my fourth time playing this game, it never ceases to amaze me where I le legit get stuck at. I mean, I don't know why. Sometimes I just forget where I'm going and I get stuck. But, you know, this is the fourth playthrough now and you think I'd have it down packed by now, but obviously I don't. But we'll get there eventually. We'll figure it out eventually. And there you have it, the bell goes off in my head, and there's the rope to actually swing over to get into the metro system. So, finally went off in my head, there it is! So, let's get into this dark, dreary, scary looking metro system that never ceases to scare the absolute crud out of me. Entering the tunnels. Hey, can you hear me? I'll meet you soon. Here I come. Hey, is anybody there? Doesn't look good. Oh, my God. Uh. 
Fucker bit me. A volatile. Lots of those fuckers in the sewers. Let's get through the light quickly. Where's the uh, oh, later? We have to move. <laughs> Resist it. It'll pass. <laughs> Just stay strong. Didn't have it on him. Let's go. I don't have the key. I swear. Now that's that, that, that's over. Our fun experience with the volatile for the first time in this playthrough and we got a flipping flashlight finally, but again, we got bitten by a volatile and let's go see what this has in store for us. I've been trying not to talk over the cutscenes because even though I've seen it before and you might have seen it before, I still don't like really talking over the cutscenes, but here we go. I don't know what you're talking about. Let him go. You're gonna make him let him go, punk? Select him, stupid. Bring it! That the best. Well, you know, you wanna see us bring it, so we're gonna go ahead and bring it. So this is our first actual, you know, combat in the game, aside from a... Uh, Aside from the infected, my least favorite thing about the combat is just the blocking. Every time you hit, there's a block, but sometimes you get lucky. But I don't really like the tutorials when I've played it so many times, but, you know, we just gotta get through the tutorial, so we're gonna kick some renegade butt and keep on going and see where it ends us up. We're gonna go look for Mia and see where we go from there. Come here. Who was that? There's no time in my pocket. 
I left you something. Well, what is this? A GRE access key. The peacekeepers, they found it. We cannot lose it. You were gonna tell me what happened to my sister. Where's Mia? You will go to Fisheye. There, ask for a girl named the Wan. Give that to her. With it and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone will die. Waltz? Is Waltz here? Yes. Oh, they're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run! We'll go together. Take this. All right, let's go. Fuck! There's our lost lamb, and he's not alone. We can fix this. Slaughter him. You are sick. Finally getting one of my favorite weapons. I prefer the ones that aren't the bat. I like the ones with the sharper edge because it's easier to defeat your enemies. And I really don't like doing the whole parkour combat. Sometimes it takes me a little bit when I'm actually fighting more than one enemy, more than the enemies that are slow like this. It takes me a little bit to actually get a grip on the button. So I'm not too crazy on the parkour combat. I mean, it's, uh, it's pretty complicated. I've always been a bigger fan of the boat and arrow and stuff like that, but... We're gonna get her done either way, so let's go ahead and take on these guys and defeat these guys so we can keep on going. So we defeated the Renegades, and that is going to be it for this video. We're going to move on with some cutscenes in the next video. So thank you guys so much for watching, and as usual, guys, I'll see you guys next time in the next video.